Little by little, officials are getting a sense of what lies beneath the thick layer of mud that envelops this picturesque corner of the American Northwest on Saturday. It's not a pretty picture. Such was the speed and ferocity of the mudslide that it appears many in Oso were unable to escape and ended up being buried alive. What we're finding is these vehicles are like twisted and tore up into like pieces. You know, I saw a car out there and I saw one one piece of the car, like an eighth of the car, and it was just all twisted and and, and uh, it, it's it's it is just amazing the magnitude and the force that this slide has created, what it has done. Almost as troubling as the rising death toll, the revelation that a government scientist warned of a catastrophe of precisely this kind as long ago as 1999, yet still people were allowed to build homes here. Officials insist the mudslide was completely unforeseen and are suggesting that a small earthquake in the area a few days earlier could have been to blame. As the death toll rises here, officials are warning that the rescue and recovery operation could be a long one. They vowed to find all the victims, but concede that could take weeks, if not months.